Okay, this one is for all you children at heart, okay, in keeping with the holiday season. This one is called Santa's Last Sleigh Ride. Summer is a busy time up here, in this the land of the reindeer. We've shelves to stock, ladders to climb. For idle banter, there's no time. Though Christmas seems so far away, it draws nearer with each new day. Nights get longer, frost will appear. Before you know, it will be here. Though the morning was not half done, Santa kindly thanked everyone for their years of service to him. Santa's voice suddenly grew dim. Then he tugged at his long white beard and announced what we all had feared. Little heat was left in his fire. Time had come for him to retire. Oh, how he ached from soul to crown. Too many chimneys he swooped down. All those hard landings took their toll and nights dancing to rock and roll. For this Christmas will be my last. I must stop living in the past. Now is the time to say goodbye, he said with a tear in his eye. We all went on working that day, not really knowing what to say. Though Pinocchio said in jest, all he needs is a good night's rest. The next day, gloom was in the air, though we all battled the despair. Santa would have none of the gloom. His bright sparkle lit up the room. His smile comforted everyone. So much work was there to be done. Oh, little time was there to mope. Soon would come the season of hope. Oh, the days and nights whizzed on by. Santa's sleigh was ready to fly for the last time on Christmas Eve. Oh, how hard it seemed to believe. Old man Winter stopped by that day to chat briefly. He could not stay around to watch Santa depart. Santa felt a chill in his heart. Jack Frost came too for the last time to reminisce and watch him climb in his sleigh for his final run. He said to Santa, it's been fun. Then all the elves gathered around him without uttering a sound. In their eyes, they all had big tears. Then Santa smiled to their loud cheers. The toy maker next said goodbye as Santa muttered, my oh my. For a short while, Santa just sat. Then he put on his gloves and hat. Pinocchio had the last word. He spoke softly, but Santa heard. Santa responded, what a shame. I never learned to spell your name. We heard him say, I must move on. Before we knew it, he was gone. On his way to bring hope and joy to each and every girl and boy. His pace was hurried as before. Not but one child would he ignore. Like a comet, his sleigh zoomed high in the starry winter's night sky. His familiar sight brought great glee to those who caught a glimpse briefly of him in the wee hours, pray tell. Good Lord, everyone wished him well. Oh, his final stop was well planned. Santa barked out his last command, pointing downward with his right hand. The reindeer knew just where to land. On the roof of a brick cape cod, it landed near a lightning rod, just where he pointed on a dime. He grabbed his sack for the last time. Grandpa Chandler heard the sleigh's thump. The excitement made his heart thump. As down the chimney Santa came, to Grandpa Santa looked the same. Merry Christmas, Santa cried out, as Grandpa stood there tall and stout. He was then speechless, though he smiled. Santa still saw in him the child. To see you, to still a great joy, like it was when I was a boy. You've not aged since last we met, said Grandpa, I'll never forget. Grandpa's eyes lit up like the moon, then he whistled a merry tune. As Santa hummed in harmony, a joyful sight was it to see. Santa then winked as he recalled that little boy who was enthralled. The very first time their paths crossed. He saw the magic was not lost. Santa placed presents round the tree as Grandpa poured for him some tea. Though it was never Santa's style, he sat down to chat for a while. Santa asked why he was awake at this wee hour, for heaven's sake. Santa said, Grandpa said he'd much to do still, presents to wrap, stockings to fill. 
Santa watched with a cheerful face as Grandpa dashed from place to place. Like that little boy he once knew, he said, I see myself in you. Grandpa thanked him for his kind praise. Oh, in the end, charity pays, said Santa with a gleeful grin. Grandpa firmly nodded his chin. Grandpa then asked if it is true, is this the last hurrah for you? Santa tugged at his long white beard, just as the dawn's first light appeared. Santa said, Grandpa, you'll not die, or grow old long as reindeer fly. And we children at heart dream on, for yesterday is never gone. You'll live on like Christmas has passed, long as cherished memories last. And elves dance in the dawn's first light, you'll always be a welcome sight. Thanks, said Santa, I must move on. Before Grandpa blinked, he was gone. Grandpa heard him shout, loud and clear, Merry Christmas! See you next year! <laughs>